The high school senior was on his way to a golf match when he crashed along Brown Road in Oxford Township. His father tells me the 17 year old had a passion and zest for life and was as loyal a friend as they come. He was so passionate about it. And that's what it's all about. Passion. You can't teach passion. Within only a few months of meeting at Tri-County Golf Ranch, Stephen Waxman knew 17-year-old Tyler Carter had potential on the golf course and even more in life. He was joyful, mature, and polite. And there are 50, 60 kids here every day, but there was something really special about him. By all accounts, Tyler had a bright future ahead that was cut short. The Colerain senior was driving to a golf match at Talawanda last Monday when investigators say he lost control and crashed on Brown Road. He died two days later. I went, no, no way. I hope it's not the Tyler I know. That same shock rippled through the Colerain community, students honoring Tyler at Friday night's football game. And he always wore these really cool Hawaiian golf shirts. Students wore Hawaiian shirts and mismatched Crocs, replicating Tyler's iconic style. His father says Tyler loved photography and was an avid fisherman and bowler. The youngest of four was loyal to family and friends. He really touched my heart. We were friends. Tyler's age ended in seven. Waxman's began with it. I'll never forget him. God needed a good man. That's the way I see it. Tyler's family says he was an organ donor, giving his liver, kidneys, pancreas, and more. That says a lot about him. You know, he's going to be saving lives. Tyler's Celebration of Life services are being held this Saturday. Now in lieu of flowers, the family is asking for donations, which will go to support youth missions, also the Colerain golf team, and the Boy Scouts. We have full information for you on WNWT.com. At Corrine High School, Jatera McGee, WNWT News 5.